What's up, y'all? This is Trill 3 ls Trillion Dollar Men. So I want to talk real quick about this URL canceling Summer Madness 6 pay-per-view. Now, um, real quick, obviously they have their reasons as to why. One of them being the bootlegging that's been going on with the live streams. Um, pretty sure they got some other reasons. The reward is probably not as big as they would want it to be for all the trouble that they got to go through to put on a pay-per-view. But it's still going to be a major loss for y'all by y'all not having it. Every league nowadays has pay-per-view for their big events. Especially like something like Summer Madness 6 that needs a pay-per-view. It's kind of a commonplace to have that now for your event. Um, so it's like more leagues are going to be talked about in between different events. Like in between them dropping battles. So y'all already had an issue where the fans felt like y'all wasn't dropping y'all battles quick enough. I mean, I feel like y'all kind of fixed that. Y'all been drop, dropping the battles a little bit quicker. But you got a situation where it's um, T-Rex versus K-Shawn. When that went down, it was a live stream. So the 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 bloggers were able to give their recaps. The, um, the media, like Hip Hop Is Real, was able to go out there. You know, well, they act the actual event anyway, so... But more fans was looking into what's going on with the event. People were talking about T-Rex and K-Shine before the the battle dropped. You know what I'm saying? Because they seen it on the live stream. So when they heard the bloggers talking about it, when they heard, when they seen the videos that Hip Hop is Real, Hip Hop is Real was um, uploading, they were more, they was able to give more feedback and have more debates. URL was able to stay in the people's mind until they were able to drop the battles. You get what I'm saying? So it's like, now that y'all don't have the pay-per-view, people are going to kind of hear about the battles that happened or what happened at the battle from people tweeting on Twitter and um, all the other social media, but they're not going to be able to be in tune and give too much feedback because they don't know what's going on until you actually drop the battle. So people are going to be talking about King of the Dot more in their events because they got the live stream. People are going to be talking about RBE. People are going to be talking about Queen of the Ring if they got any events coming up with the live stream. Same thing with Bullpen Battle League. It's the same thing. Like They're going to be talking about them more because y'all don't have or y'all not giving any content to talk about. Um, I mean, obviously, y'all going to have y'all PG battles that y'all going to drop in between the different events and all that. But what other battles do y'all really have to drop in between those, man? Um, it's a, it's a, I can talk about this all day, honestly. But um, let me know how y'all feel about it. Comment, rate, hit that subscribe button. Trill 3 L's, Trillion Dollar Man, y'all. Peace.